Hey YouTube, it's Uncle Tony 99 it's Tony. What's going on tonight guys? How are you guys doing? Tonight's video is going to be a review and comparison video of the Snaztec Epics, these guys right here, and the eBay Epics, available on eBay. Um, the Snaztec Epics, I'm sure you guys have seen them already, are available from UnlimitedCase.com started by a fellow YouTuber, that snazzy iPhone guy, who's now going by the name This iPhone Guy, I believe. Um, the Snaztec Epics are available from, as I said, UnlimitedCase.com. They're $12.99 each, and they include a screen shield and a microfiber. The eBay Epics are available, obviously, on eBay. Uh, I believe the seller's name is David CA2009. Um, they do not include a screen shield. You just get these uh, these cases. No screen shield, no microfiber included with these. And they're four for twelve dollars with free shipping. I got free shipping to Canada, guys. I never get free shipping to Canada. I think it's the first time I've ever bought anything. That it was free shipping to Canada. I was super excited about that. I was like, really? Yes! Right on! So, I picked some up. I had to, right? We had this first. Um, this is the eBay, this is the Unlimited Case Epic. And I bought these in different colors on purpose, guys, so I would not get them confused, so that I would be able to tell you guys which ones came from where. I didn't want any confusion. Um, if I got the same colors, it might have, it might have been better for review purposes. But I didn't want to get them confused. I wanted to make sure I knew which ones came from where. So, as you can see, this is simply a protective back cover for your iPhone. Um, and they do include a screen shield from Unlimited Case. Um, I didn't, I'm not using one of these on my phone, but I did do an install of one of these on my future brother-in-law's phone. Corey, you saw, you've heard his name mentioned in my videos before. Fiora talks about him. He's her future stepdad. Um, and this is a screen shield. It's one of those two-tab jobs, and uh, the microfiber obviously is in here. This thing is essentially useless. Um, I tried to actually tear this. You can't actually tear it, but it's really papery and super thin. You can see my finger through the back of it, and it's really essentially useless. So you might as well say that it doesn't include one because it is essentially useless. The screen shield, on the other hand, is not bad. Um, I've, seen, I've certainly seen worse. It is one of the two-tab versions. Um, I'll lay it down on my screen here so you guys can see it. Um, it is slightly smaller than the actual screen of the iPhone. You guys can see me in the camera. What's up, guys? Um, it seems to, it appears to be cut out very well. The cutouts, oh, I have it backwards. That was brilliant tone. You didn't even notice that for a few seconds, man. Um, as you can see, it appears to be cut very well. The holes line up and everything quite well. Um, I had no trouble with the install went very easily and um, it appears to be a pretty decent screen shield. It's pretty clear, doesn't make the screen milky or anything. Um, it's a pretty decent screen shield. It's a little bit on the thick side, but it's not a bad screen shield at all, guys. So, you know, it's pretty decent. Um, not on par quality-wise, I would say, with, say, SGP, who make supremely wicked screen shields. I guess I've used their screen shields before and they're fantastic. Or uh, power support. I haven't used a power support but I've heard excellent things about them. Um, but it is a decent screen shield. Um, it, it's not a bad screen shield. So we'll get into the cases now. Um, these are the Epic cases from Unlimited Case and this is the eBay Epic. As you can see the Apple logo is the same, the iPhone logo is the same, the writing is the same, the font is the same. They appear to be identical. I'm going to zoom in on these 
real close for you if I can. If my camera will focus. Uh, a little bit out maybe. There we go. So you can see the writing. Um, the writing appears to be identical on both cases. And it is in fact identical. Same font and, and everything. I read the entire thing. I got a magnifying glass out when I was uh, checking these out earlier. And uh, read the writing and everything and it is exactly the same. Um, Quinn, that snazzy iPhone guy, has insisted that these are not the same as the unlimited case epics. His are in fact better quality. Um, I'm going to respectfully disagree with them. I have used both of these. I've held them side by side and looked at them. Um, here's another point to reinforce my point. Um, these appear to be made in sheets in a mold or something and then you have this jaggedy little line see that little wirble on the bottom there where they're broken off the mold you see that looks like it's broken off the mold there where that, that is on the Snastack Epic take a look at the eBay Epic exactly the same thing there on the bottom there you see that these couldn't be more identical if you bought them from the same place, guys. Um, I, I'm unable to tell any difference between the two of them. Plastic feels like it's the same stiffness. Um, you have two little lines running down on this one and this in the middle. Same two lines running down the middle of this one. It's not showing up on my camera for some reason. I don't know why. But see, you got the two lines running down the center there on that one two lines running down the center there on that one. There you can see it there. Um, they appear for all intents and purposes guys to be exactly the same thing. Are they worth $12.99 from Unlimited Case? I'm gonna say no guys. I'm gonna say if you're looking for a, a case like this go to eBay. Get them off of eBay then head over to the Apple Store and buy some screen shields guys or order some from SGP. They have excellent screen shields. Um, so to install this, we simply lay it in, like so. Uh, no button side first, and then press it on. Now what I have noticed with these is that you gotta give them that extra push. You guys hear that snap in there? So that it snaps in. Um, that edge is quite sharp. Um, I have been concerned about it scratching my phone. It hasn't yet. But I think if I was going to rock these on a regular basis, I would take a piece of 200 grit sandpaper and just smooth that edge a little bit. You know what I mean? Not a lot. I want to take off a lot of material or it's going to mess with the fit. But just smooth that sharp edge there because it does have a sharp edge there. You guys hear that? This one is, a, is a identical, guys. It's got the exact same sharp edge. Oh, ouch. I didn't scratch my phone, did I? These are really tight to get on and off, too, guys. You gotta be careful putting these on and off. Um, sharp edge, sharp edge. You guys see that, right? They appear to be identical in every way. Um, I'll put this one on. It doesn't quite go on all the way. You gotta snap it on that little bit extra. Exactly the same as the one from eBay. Um, so, um, yeah, these, uh, are, are kind of cool. Um, obviously, you get what you pay for. The quality is not the same as an SGP Ultra Thin. Go back in my videos, I reviewed the SGP Ultra Thin. It is an awesome case. It fits like a glove, it pops on and off really easily. Awesome case. Um, if you're in the market for something like this, if you want these funky colored ones and stuff, I would recommend going over to eBay and picking these up. It's it's really your call, guys, wherever you want to buy these from. Personally, me, I'd head over to eBay and I'd pick them up from there. So that's it. That's my review and comparison video of the Snaztac Epics and the eBay Epics. Thanks for watching. Follow me on Twitter, twitter.com forward slash Uncle Tone 99. And we'll see you next time, guys, all right? Thanks for watching. Peace.